what you see before you is not exactly what one would call a game. It's more like an interactive meditation, reenacted from scattered evidence that happened to fall into our hands. It was built according to instructions, left by the original archive's un anonymous donor. Many strange things and unclear moments you will encounter in this g whatever it is, are due to the requirements outlined in the archive. Maybe it was just a mysterious hoax, but it probably wasn't. We suggest that you view it as just another urgent urban legend. We recommend you play this in the dark, in a quiet place. Alone. Which I am. Now, in the interest of full disclosure, I have played this slightly. And... I have decided to do this Let's Play for someone who requested it. So I'm going to start again, and uh, you'll see what the hell's going on. I have made no sense of this game. Something woke me up. Did a window break somewhere? Or did the door open? It will be hard to find. huge house with tens of rooms, but I haven't looked in all of them for a long time. I've been feeling so exhausted lately. What a migraine, as if someone is pounding a hole in my poor skull. As you can hear, it's just gibberish when he's talking, but I'll try to read it out as best I can. I'm terribly tired. I've been... S I've even started sleepwalk last night. I woke up standing right here at the door. If it hadn't been bolted, I would have ended up outside at night. This door has to be locked securely. That's really a pain in the ass to read when he's gibbering like that, so I'm just going to let you read it. Well, that's OCD for you, isn't it? I'm out here and I'm wanting to turn off the light as I leave. But at the same time, I want to leave it on. As you can see from the clock in the uh, top left hand corner, it is not moving.
If anyone makes any sense of what they can see here, let me know because I'm confused. Now, in this sequence, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to do something or whatever, but I just kept wandering until I found a house. That's new. I can't go back there either. You see that in the background? Little girl? I haven't seen that before. Oh, I can. Let's see if I can approach. She's gone. Oh, there's a house over there. The game is very interesting but weird. <laughs> Now that icon means you hide behind your bed. <laughs> From what I can tell, in these sequences where the time is actually moving, you have to wait until it's daylight. And that clock has to be completely lit up for it to um to be daylight. When he's closed his eyes, he's waiting for his eyes to adjust to the light so he can see properly. <laughs> 
Oh, there you go. It is good to turn off the light. The light's on the way out. If you didn't understand what that said, it said I want to see you. Just when you thought about it, it came in. Now it's your turn. Wait. I think I'll just wait for the day. Wait a second. The clock's going backwards while I'm hiding. Hey, you. Huh. I get that feeling that you're being watched. Oh, that's me zooming out just then. Reach daytime. Hide and seek in the dark. This is a test of courage. So you shouldn't really hide when you when you play. Just try to play fair and wait for the game to end. If the seeker sees that someone is hiding, everything will start from the beginning again. The key is you have to guess how the, the seeker interprets the game. So if he says to someone, you're hiding, but that person is standing in the open, then it is, is that hot or not? That it is not about being seen or not. It's a bit of a funny font. <laughs> Yeah, that's how I look when I wake up as well.
It's telling me to turn the lights on, but before he was telling me to turn it off. Time isn't moving again. And I'm using the lantern again. That little girl's gonna show up again. atmosphere in this game is really impressive. I mean for a 2D game it's it's got quite impressive features. Not to mention it looks pretty. Oh, this is where I was up to before I started again. Mind you, it's been different since the last time I played, so... I don't think that matters. Up or down? At least I got somewhere to hide. Good place to hide. <laughs> Alright, I'll go there next. It's 
when I start hearing the voices when things get a little bit harder. I hear you walking... Like that! You trapped yourself. this. Made it to daybreak. You should play this game alone. Get up three hours before sunrise. Say this to yourself three times. I didn't forget anything. I didn't forget anything. I didn't forget anything. Walk through your darkened house and turn on the light in each room. Go back to the room you started in. Close your eyes. Try to focus on all the first things that come to mind. If you imagine you're a face, that being that being will come to life in your home. Well. Okay then. I don't know what these symbols represent, but I'm dreading that big monster at the top there. game but I'm leaving it at that for now thanks for watching and tune in next time for me to continue playing this <laughs>